share uh, since you have been re uh, researching on Ayurveda since five years, I am sure you are uh, you are full of insights. <laughs> yes, can you please share for me and for my viewers um, your takeaways from Ayurveda? It's very simple. It's okay. living in alignment with nature. Wow. Yes. Amazing. It's so simple. So, depending on your genetic makeup, mm -hmm. your Prakriti, mm -hmm. and Prakriti, yeah. Prakriti yeah. and then your current conditions, your Vrikriti. Okay. Um, Vrikriti. Vrikriti. Okay. Yes. Wow, cool. So Beautiful. my Prakriti is Vata. It's Vata. very airy. Okay. Vata. My Vrikriti is Pitta. It's very fiery. Mm. So my um, natural essence, my nature, mm. is uh, quite. Sorry, I just got sunscreen in my eye. <laughs> you would want some. <laughs> oh no, I, it's just the sunscreen. I think okay. not the sun. Um, uh, is quite dry and hot. Okay. So for me, it's beneficial to be in areas, climates that are a little bit more humid. So okay. the humid, your humid weather is better for me because it's damp. Mm. And foods I need to eat are um, <laughs> sorry. Oh, that's all right. Yeah, I just got. Continue. Yes, very simple. Living in alignment with nature, according to the seasons, mm -hmm. according to your climate, what kind of climate you're living in, mm -hmm. and according to your prakriti and vrikriti. Okay. Yes. So, how did you figure out your prakriti? I mean, I just wanted to ask if somebody has to uh, figure out their prakriti, and how do you do that? You can see a Vedic astrologer, or you need astrologer for you don't you don't necessarily need that. You um, can, you can diagnose yourself technically if you are honest. Okay. You have to be very honest and aware, okay. aware of yourself. Aware of yourself. Yes. So if you are, if you can look at yourself and be like, "Ooh, I am quite a scattered person. I, I easily get anxious. Mm. I am quite airy. It's hard for me to focus." Okay. Then being honest with yourself would be like, "I'm probably a vata constitution." Okay. And if your zodiac is is in the element of air, let's say, okay. so you can you can judge it like that yourself, or you can see an Ayurvedic doctor. Ayurvedic doctor, yeah, yeah. That is or a Vedic astrologer, or a medicine astrologer. We have uh, institutes over here in India, which are totally dedicated to Ayurveda. Yes, uh, Ayurveda Medical Institute. And if you have been to Delhi, there are a few. Yes, really authentic ones. Yes. Okay, so that's what.